Welcome back to this week's vlog. Um, this is Von Miller, and we are in playoff mode. So this is a playoff vlog. And um, starting the playoffs, I like to get off all social media. I don't get on Twitter, I don't get on Instagram. You know, no, I haven't deactivated any of my stuff, but I just deleted it off of my phone. And that started back in 2015. And I really got that from LeBron. I saw that he went on like a playoff, like blackout, and they won a championship that year. So I decided to try the same thing, and that's what I did. So that's probably why you see like it's time on my Instagram feed, and I don't like post any like stories or anything because I'm really active on social media. But right now it's playoff mode. We're getting ready to play the Cardinals, and I just want everything to be silent. I want all of my focus to be on my craft. All the focus is on my craft, and I have a lot of time. So what I like to do is just pour that back into my body. You know, I hit the cold tubs every single day. I get my body worked on every single day. Um, I watch film every single day. I watch my notes. I practice hard every single day. And these are things that you would say, like, this is what you should be doing all season long. But to be honest with you, like, it's a long season. So things change. You can't really control the variables during the season the way you can in the playoffs. So I have this unique opportunity being with the Los Angeles Rams. We have a unique team. Our opportunity is now, and I want to pour everything that I have into my team and into my teammates and into my family. That's why I got off of all social media. And I feel like that really helps with my, um, I would say like my mental health and like that helps me focus on like the task at hand. I love to spend time at the house. Um, if you know me, you know I'm a homebody. And if I can create any outside activity at home, I do it. In this instance, I have a really good chef, Chef V. I've had a lot of great chefs, a lot of amazing chefs. But chef V is um, it's perfect for me at this time of my life. And I don't even think it's the time of my life. She's just a really, really good chef and she, she does her job very, very well. And I met her through Odell. She came up to Colorado Springs with Odell. We were training with Chris and I met her and um, I had some of her food and I felt her energy. And I was like, bro, wow, this is amazing. And I talked to her that day when she was in Colorado Springs. She said she was in LA. So when I got traded, the very first thing I did was call Chef V. And a week later, we picked up Odell, and the very first thing that he did was call Chef V, but she was already booked, like with me. So this dinner that I had at my house, Chef V cooked, and it was me and Odell, and it was Lo, and it was Dave, and Vince. And, you know, we had everybody here, and me and Odell started talking about Chef V and how I took her from him. On, on November 1st, I called her. And I signed November 13th. I booked her before like Oda got her. Bro, she told me about the delivery schedule. She's like, yeah, so I can just drop off some drop it off. But I have to keep my word. My word's everything, you know? My bad, bro. No, that's good. It's all us. I'll see you guys later. Bye, y'all. I was going to be a Cleveland Brown forever. Like, I didn't know he was going to come to Los Angeles around. This is the first playoff game at SoFi Stadium. This is the first Monday night playoff game ever in NFL history. We go into the stadium and it's, it's, a, it's a great atmosphere. Like everybody's there. I'm talking about everybody in LA is at this game. And we start off the game so hot. My very first pass rush, it felt so good. And I knew it was gonna be a great day. Um, I didn't know that we were gonna beat them the way that we did. Um, because it's Kyler Murray and you got, uh, you know, his defense challenge on J.J. Watt. I, I thought it was going to be a tight game to the very, very end. But we came out so hot that the game was pretty much done in like halftime, which is a good thing. You know, we were able to rest and we were able to get ready for a, uh, a Tampa Bay Buccaneers team that's coming up this week. This whole playoffs, you know, I've been going to the proactive. Um, I've been hopping in the cold tub. We have cold tubs and hot tubs at the at the Rams facility. But, um, you know, this one is cool because 
I said proactive, proactive has a, a crazy simulator, crazy golf simulator, which nobody uses. It's 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 insane. They have one of the, the state of the art golf simulator and nobody uses it. So every time I go in there to use a the cold tub, before I hop in the cold tub, I hop on the simulator. While we mentioned the golf simulator, Ativa got me the stealth drivers, brand new. It's only been out for like a couple of days. And he got me one and I actually hopped on a simulator with it. And it's amazing. Like it's got the carbon fiber like face. You know, this shaft didn't come with it. You know, this is a shaft that I, that I had. The shaft is super expensive too. The hazardous uh, smoke shaft. But this driver is just ridiculous. And I did like 30 shots with this, with this driver. And I only had one bad ball. It's, it's, it's really amazing because I'm, start, I'm still learning out how to like hit the thing. But on this particular day, like I went crazy with it, like this driver and I'm definitely like putting this in the bag. So shout out like Atiba and we'll get you all of that footage like, you know, right after this. Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah, I'm out, man. <laughs> I'm out, man. New stale driver, man. We got the Bucks coming up. Um, it's gonna be a crazy game. I'm like I played Tom Brady um, twice before in the playoffs, and it's always a tough game. Really, the first game it really wasn't tough at all. Like he killed us. But the second game it came down to like a two point conversion for us to win it and go to the Super Bowl. And um, you know I combined both of those experiences facing Tom Brady and our um, regular season experiences facing Tom Brady, and I can just only imagine that this game is going to be crazy as well. Um, I've been preaching to the guys like every week is a Super Bowl. You know, it's not like a um, a game where you just play to get to a Super Bowl. This is our Super Bowl. You know, this is our biggest game that we're gonna play. Then next week will be our biggest game that we have played. And we're playing Tom Brady and the Bucks in Tampa Bay. It's gonna be wild, man. I get to see Shaq, you know, JPP, you know, face Tom Brady. All these guys are my guys, man. It's gonna be a crazy game. And I'm, I just know, like, next week, we're gonna be talking about playing the 49ers, you know, back at home. You know, I, I speak it into existence. You know, we're gonna go out here and get this win. We're gonna play well. I'm gonna play well. Everybody on my team is gonna play well. And we continue these playoff vlogs next week. You wanna do, like, predictions for the game, like, performance beforehand? Like, no, it's good, bro. I don't wanna jinx it. Yeah. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. We're gonna beat their ass. Put that on the blog next week. Put that on the vlog next week. We're gonna beat their ass. And I fucking hit the driver all week and hopped in the cold tub. So put that on there. Thanks for watching this week's playoff vlog. Stealth driver footage coming out. You know, I appreciate the love and support, man. This is the playoff vlogs. It's Von Miller, DJ Sauce when they're done. And I'm out.